with a new story. Today, I have a story for you of a one girl. Her name, her name is Chinky. So, let's start today's story. Today's story name is Chinky's Flower. Chinky's Beautiful Flower. Once upon a time, there was a big tree. On that tree, there lived a beautiful bird. Choo, 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 choo. One day, the bird went to bring some food for her. And when she was away from the nest, there came one hunter. And he kept one big net near the nest. Now, poor bird, she did not know about that. And when she came back, she got caught inside the net. And now she was so sad and she started screaming, Help! Help! Please help me! I want to be free! Help me! Now, there came one little girl whose name is Chinky. Chinky saw the bird. Oh, little bird, don't worry. I am coming to help you. Don't worry, bird. And she came and then she freed the bird. And then the bird flew away from there. Now, Chinky was very happy to see the bird. After many days, again Chinky came near the same tree. And she was sitting under the tree with a beautiful rose flower. Because Chinky liked the rose flower. And she was smelling the flower. Ah, what a sweet, sweet smell of the rose flower. But after some time, suddenly the same bird came and took the flower from the chinky and flew away. Now chinky was shocked. Oh no! How thankless this bird! I have saved her life and she took my rose flower. Oh no! She got up from there and started to catch the bird. And suddenly she saw a poisonous snake. Hiss! Hiss! Now the chinky realized that the bird was not thankless. If the bird had not taken the flower, then the poisonous snake would have bitten her. So the bird saved her life. Okay, so what is the moral of the kids? Without knowing, don't misjudge people's intention. If you like my stories, please like, share and subscribe my channel. Let's meet again next Friday. Till then, bye-bye.